Okay, uh, this is the uh, last, 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 uh, last league match of this season. Um, it's against the person I haven't played against yet, uh, Fika. Um, yeah, uh, let's see. There's some amount of extra background noise that I guess on the recording, I think I'm going to be able to quash pretty well, but, um, will probably still be kind of a distraction for me, even if you all can't hear it, so, uh, I don't know. I don't know how that'll be. Um, let's see. This match, I need, like, I don't know. I'm, I'm like, minus two right now. Um, I think 3-3 uh, three, three will make things shaky. Worse than 3-3 three, three will be uh, almost certain demotion, and better than 3-3 three, three probably gives me a pretty good chance at staying up. Uh, but, uh, and I guess in addition to the, to the background noise, I had, like, just, I don't know if it was, I think I was actually sick, um, the last two days, like, just complete terrible nasal discharge. It might have been allergies, but, uh, I think it, I think it was probably sickness, um, illness, and, uh, I hadn't been sleeping the greatest. Um, anyways... Uh, at last we have a board here. Oh yeah, there's, there's this discussion about, uh, Lich, which, uh, I got a, I got a nice comment on today's Minute About video about how it's, I guess, Lich, which, I mean, I'll buy, but I'm also never gonna say, cause this is like a word that I started using two and a half, three years ago, whenever, whenever Lich started being a thing in, uh, Allies playtesting. Um, Anyways, yeah, so I think we're going to open, I think we're going to delay the pools. Yeah, I think you want, like, a lot of pools, but, but Coven looks really important. I think we're going to open Caravan Guard Patron, actually, uh, with the intent of, like, putting in, you know, draw. Um, I think Coven is really, really important. Uh, there's no trashing, and, like, although pool patrons are really big deal. Um, I think it can be pretty, potentially pretty tough to get through um, curses if you end up having more of them. So we're going to open Caravan Guard Patron with the intent of picking up like Potion and either Barge or Scholar. Uh, I guess we also want Silos. It's awkward. Well, I'm going to start Caravan Guard Patron anyways and, and live with live with whatever consequences. Okay, well, here's our five. Uh, so a decision is here to be made. I think it's going to be... Well, I don't really want to do Scholar. I think we'll do Barge. Uh, and then maybe pick up Silos here. Um, oh, I have five again. This could, this could be a Coven or another Barge, actually. Uh, that's a funny thing that happens with Caravan Guard. I wasn't even thinking that it, like, would possibly produce a coin. Interesting. Um, and maybe we'll grab a second barge. I mean, the opportunity's here. <laughs> and this can go for next turn. Uh, now I really do want to pick up that silos. We'll, we'll see if we can get the, we'll see if we can get the barge going, uh, well. I guess this could also be exploration, but I, mean, I think I, I think I want to be playing barge every turn. Um, let's see, no caravan guards in here. Um, now what? This has gone, like, totally unexpectedly, so now I guess I start picking up Covens, uh, since my draws were, were that magical. Um, we'll hope that you don't, like, see things that I actually want uh, with the pools, um, like 
Seeing a barge there would have been pretty nasty. Alright, uh, five of these, I guess. Uh oh, caravan guard reactions. That's nice. Um, at some point I do have to pick up pool. Uh, I'm just not sure when that should happen. I think I'm just going to keep pressing the covens in. Because, like... <laughs> I don't know. I mean, you're getting through deck okay, it looks like. It's just, I haven't really... <laughs> I feel like I haven't really had this like opportunity to to put in potion. Um, okay, well both Coven's bottom deck, so now I guess we're gonna do something a little bit different. Uh, maybe now I put in like potion encampment. Um, just with the intent of I, I am gonna need I am gonna need pools. Um, missing both covens there really was was really kind of sad. Okay, it was extremely sad, especially since it looks like you're actually like getting through deck effectively enough to to maybe be playing stuff every turn. Um, yeah, not not seeing the covens last turn was just horrendous. Um, do I want to duration this? I'm a little bit hesitant to, uh, just because I know that the potion's in there. But on the other hand, like, this is nine coins, it's probably okay. We can go, like, Mountain Village Barge and be pretty happy about that. I think. We get to duration over the, over the shuffle, which is the, which is the big deal. Um. That is do that is get the barge draw before we do the silos. The mountain village is also like some minor defense against Ryan Pool. Uh, not not huge, but. Yeah. Enough. Um, this can draw now. Okay, apparently it can't draw because I'm going to bottom deck the, uh, the barge, other barge, but I think it was still the right move. And then this ends up being something like, uh, I don't know, pool, barge, pool, barge, village. Pool barge encampment, I guess, is what it would look like if I wanted to go that way. Uh, that seems okay, right? I mean, I want to put more draw in, so let's just do it this way. Uh, we should get to dump curses this upcoming turn, which is good. Um, you'll take one more, which is, oh, okay, I guess you'll actually take two more, which is actually really, really good, uh, if I manage to get through deck, which is not guaranteed at all, but that's all right. Okay, well, we played both. Um, I guess we probably want a duration this. I mean, I have the villager, but I don't know how likely I am to... Yeah, I think we're gonna, I think we're gonna keep going. Alright, this one gets duration for sure. Um, now what? Probably add villages. Uh, just two mountain villages seem like the possibly best move. Um, we're gonna have something to think about, uh, right here. Oh, yeah, actually you should discard this. Um, we're gonna have something to think about right here of whether I want to, uh, or what I, what I want to do with, um, 
the silos. I'm pretty sure we want to not do silos. Because uh, right now I can like pick up you know, Mountain Village. Uh, I'm probably not getting through this, so probably the pool. Uh, I guess I could also do um, like grab a coven duration to buy. That's probably going to be actually better. Uh, pick up coven. Do this duration, both of these. And buy just like pool caravan guard. Yeah, uh, that definitely seems like a move that I'm, that I'm liking. Everything, all of these, let's get through the deck. Yeah, that can disappear. Um, I guess we'll pick up Potion. Uh, I'm a little bit hesitant to draw with this barge. I guess we might play, play, maybe play the encampment first. Uh, and see if we didn't pick up the other one, which we didn't. So I guess this is what we're doing. Um, obviously top deck this curse. Uh, I definitely don't want to be, definitely don't want to be triggering that shuffle, I don't think. Maybe I did, it was all copper. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I probably should have actually triggered that shuffle. It's all right. We'll, we'll get over it. Um... I definitely have enough village for more barge, so probably we should take that. Uh, something like barge patron here seems okay. I have the point lead, which is making me um, more amenable to like not not worrying about piles so much. Um, which I guess it's just like re-emphasizing like how good doing getting getting the covens in was uh, earlier was. You know, discard, discard, whoops, that was not supposed to discard. I guess I get to discard some pools of yours now. Um, this is what that's meaning. Let's just work through the deck a bit. Um, there is another barge in there, I believe, so we will draw. Uh, does this just win? No, not quite. Um, so I guess we'll take pool, maybe province barge. That just like kind of puts it where I don't think you're hitting 18 in a turn and you know, I have the I have the a lot of draw, so we I think we're probably gonna be okay. Yeah, I mean look at look at this. Like you can discard stuff with pool, but I'm just I'm just way way defended. Uh obviously I was lucky to have the five five, although I think um like barge silos I would have been okay with also. Uh but on to, on to one of your starts. Oh gosh, it's like more of the same. Um, not really, uh, but it kind of feels that way. Um, this board's expensive. I think we're going to open double silver just as a guess. Uh, normally I'd say replace is like really good because it's the trashing, but then you look around and uh, you can't actually replace your estates into anything but silvers, which makes it not anywhere near as appealing uh, to have, to me at least. Uh, so probably our first fives are going to be uh, old witches. Um, more silver. Uh, you hitting 5-5 five, five could be pretty bad. Um, I mean, I think, I think this should definitely be Old Witch. 
see. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, so this is pretty devastating that I, like, am not hitting five. Uh, my main hope now is basically that your old witch misses, uh, which is not exactly, not exactly where we want to be. Um, my hope, okay, the old witch did miss. Uh, we'll take a carriage, I think. Maybe we just take another old witch. I'm trying to think about this shuffle a bit. Um, and like, what's in it? Uh, like, like, this could also be potentially like minion. Um, but it's like minion or carriage. I think we're going to go after minion. Um, just with the idea that I probably want to be able to cycle a little bit more. Uh, like, in case my old witch does this particular thing, which is actually bad because now this shuffle is ugly. So maybe I actually skip this and take another minion. I think that's what we're going to do. Because uh, I, I can't afford to make this shuffle even if I had found the old witch with that minion. Um, how are we feeling? Uh, not amazing. Um... I'm going to be pretty behind on the cursing, most likely. Um, obviously, I don't have a grand market, and the grand market's going to actually do quite a lot of work here. If you have an old witch in hand, you should be... Okay. Um, it's going to be doing quite a lot of work. I might just keep picking up minions, actually. Uh, this could be another old witch also, but... Like... I don't know. Um, yeah, I, mean, I think I'll just keep putting minions in. Uh, let's start attacking. Seems like a good thing to do. Okay, that was not a very useful uh, call, but oh well. <laughs> I mean, I think I'm okay picking up silver. I'm, I'm basically playing this kind of ugly deck. Um, the grand markets are actually kind of terrifying because, uh, they're like actual, actual, like, when you carriage them, you kind of get draw, a draw village, um, out of the deal. Uh, I'm also considering, like, replace here or something of that sort. Um, but here I'm kind of guessing another carriage does me the most good. Or maybe another old witch isn't the worst thing ever either. Um, I don't know. It's all a little... All a little funky. Um, and like here I feel like I'd so much rather attack than... You know, get the, get the village. So now we're gonna, now I think we're gonna just gonna go up and, and grab our grand market. Like, I think the attacks are substantial. Um, as much as I don't really love you continuing to get, you know, grand markets. Um, I mean, I can, I can get grand markets, right? The attacks have got to be doing something. That's that's basically my theory on minion. <laughs> like maybe you want to pick up haunted woods. That could be something that could counter those. Um, another grand market, sure. Grand markets are going kind of fast. Uh, but I think we'll just keep taking them, especially with the colonnade points. Ooh, pretty terrifying. Uh, this seems like the place where this game is turning around a bit, doesn't it? Um... Because you're about to take the the rest of the colonnade points. This is this is just a really a really good turn. Which I mean, at some point, I think that was going to happen. 
Um, like this is this is not a surprise. It's just annoying that it happened. <laughs> Still. Uh, I think the next move is probably picking up like haunted woods, maybe like right now, actually. Um, I mean, I guess they can let you top deck curses, but I'm not playing with that much old witch, so I say whatever to that. Ouch! You weren't supposed to be able to do that to me. <laughs> not like off the top of a shuffle. <laughs> oh well. Yeah, I mean, stuff over there is working better. It's working better. Um, probably our way out from here is like managing to get some kind of pile on Carriage's province. Like, we're close enough that if you manage to have a couple of uh, bad turns in a row, which is totally possible um, under this under this minion no trashing condition, um, things things could go things could go a little sideways. Um, so I don't know, I don't actually know what, like, the, uh, I mean, do I just call this? I could, like, call this take carriage, say, go hit 15. I mean, you can probably hit 15 is the thing, so I'm kind of, I'm kind of hesitant to do that. Let me just play the Haunted Woods, call it a day. Yeah, that's, I think that's what we'll do. Um, and yeah, like I'm, I'm good. Okay. Um. I mean, we're not gonna, we're not gonna discard from here. So let's just do this. Uh, I maybe want like province plus hunting grounds. Isn't the worst. I mean, it's two points, right? And I have some carriages. I don't know that I have enough carriages to really call it village support, but... It's, it's at least something. It should force you to green. Of course, you can just hit 16 and not, like, worry about such things, but... That's alright. <laughs> My hope is basically just to have like one really, really good turn. Uh, hopefully before you have your next really, really good turn. Oh no. Four, huh? I, mean, I don't really want to go over this shuffle, but I also kind of do would like to figure out a way to to do something useful this turn. Uh, might just call it. Let's lose some curses here. Yeah, there we go. Uh, I think you're just gonna hit 20. That's that's what this is looking like to me. No, nope, a little bit short. But like, this can just be two provinces and that leaves you a lot less worried about everything, really. Could and should be two provinces. Maybe you take like carriage province. I don't, I don't think so. It should just be two provinces. What am I actually going to do about that? Gold's a little funky without a replace. Well, <laughs> that doesn't actually make any sense. You can't you can't like target the gold with the replace. I think it should just be two provinces because that scores. Um, now is when I get kind of irritated by Old Witch trashing a curse for you. Uh, but we're just going to take Province. There goes one of my draw cards. That's bad. Um, 
Although I wasn't going to be able to really village with it anyways. Um, I'm not really seeing a win condition other than like somehow taking these three provinces for me, which is bad because you're about to take at least one of them. Um, I guess the, the hope is that like you have enough crud in here that taking a province is okay. Well, this just looks like 20. <laughs> All right, yeah. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I missed five the first shuffle, which was, like, so incredibly stupid and bad that winning there was going to take, was going to take something. Um, all right, what do we have here? Uh, joust game. Um, the villages look mildly important uh, there. Uh, I guess we're gonna start Silver Bounty Hunter. I'm not really sure what the what the targets are next shuffle, but um, that much seems clear. Like there's Altar, but also you can also just like kind of put in a Highwayman and be probably pretty happy with that. The things that you get with Altar is like it's like Joust. Um, the villages in here look really really important just because hideouts limited as it is. Um, Um, hmm. I could turtle this. Uh, in fact, I should, probably should turtle this. Uh, the question is, like, what to pick up on the, um, four. I'm pretty sure the answer is hideout. Uh, and then next turn we'll take, we'll take highwayman. Uh, it's not that I like particularly need the village, it's just I think that's probably the best for. Yeah. I'll play that now. And yeah, I mean I think I think Highwayman's just better than Altar. Uh, like in the interest of drawing. <laughs> that's that's what I want. This will be Joust. Since I picked up the hideout, I'm less inclined towards modify. Uh, just in general. Um, this is probably just another Joust. Uh, bounty Hunter a Copper. Or I, could, I guess I could also Bounty the Estate and buy Merchant. That's a, that's a possibility also. Um, one of the two, though. I can go this way on it. I don't really buy that I, I really need another Joust more than... I don't think I get value out of it more than Merchant. And it saves the it saves the potential plus three for, like, I don't know, a province like this turn, for example. Um, like, this could be province right now, and I think it wants to be. I don't know that we'll collide, but uh, just just get it in there off the off the plus three coin spike seems like a seems like a good thing to do. Uh, while while the plus three coin spike is is still available like that, your bounty hunter missed something. It missed it missed your first shuffle. Oh yeah, I guess I guess he likes just full uh, full everything missed. Your your bounty hunter missed your first whatever, which is huge advantage for me. So yeah, I should I should end up winning this game, assuming I don't do anything overly stupid. Uh, I'm not even sure what qualifies, but you know. That's that's about where we're at right now. Uh, this just wants to be 
Maybe it wants to be House Carl, so that I can redraw the, uh, what's it? Yeah, it wants to be House Carl, so that I can draw the, uh, Highwayman, like that. Uh, somebody will be happy about the first thing being House Carl. Um, I could pick up another province here, that actually doesn't seem so bad. Right? I get to do two rewards next turn. Sounds that sounds good. Especially since I'm gonna be a little bit village dependent or a little bit dependent on them for village. Like this can be um Corsair Corsair Corse 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 Corsi Corse. Okay. Yeah. Uh don't let your bounty hunter miss the shuffle. That was that was the moral of that game, I think. Uh, back to, back to your start. Um, now this looks funky. Where's the draw? There is none. Um, is there anything with Guild Hall? Not really. Um, is Page useful? I mean, it's gotta be, because there's, like, warriors sitting in there, and... Everything costs in in range. Um, I'm tempted to open Spice Merchant Remake. Uh, you can do that with Borrow. Um, it's kind of just a weakish board, but like I don't know. Like, do I borrow for Spice Merchant? Maybe. It's kind of a tough decision. I'm not going to open Page. Well, maybe that is the alternative to borrowing for Spice Merchant. I think I think we're just going to do it this way. Uh, I could pick up another Spice Merchant here. Okay, well, that is irritating at best. Um, I'm also kind of concerned that, like, next turn I miss two, um, if I don't pick up Paige, like, right now. So maybe that's, that's what we want to do. Um, there was, there was also a pretty good argument for, um, student with Crafter's Guild. I kind of missed that, but it's fine. I'm also actually fine with having multiple page lines going. Um, I think it's probably actually a good idea, even. Your page miss. Your page missed. Teach you to open page. I mean, I don't think you're complaining, but mission walls. Yeah, we're gonna pick up another page. Not too unhappy about that. Things are going okay over there. We're probably going to be kind of close-ish to even, though. Um, if I can, if I can find appropriate things this turn. Um, Like that. Uh, this is all copper. So this probably goes to wishing well, trash of copper. I don't know, maybe we pick up chariot race. We could also pick up another wishing well. It's not the, not the worst. Uh, we could pick up another page line going up. Uh, next turn could get kind of ugly though. Yeah, let's go wishing well. And we're gonna we're gonna convert both of those over. Hopefully that's the no. Okay. Well, this turn's bad. Um, it's actually maybe okay. I'm gonna get like treasure hunter plus warrior in there. Um, the the main problem is like this treasure hunter is about to take three silvers, which again maybe not the worst thing, but. Definitely feels like a little bit of a disadvantage, especially with you like already having Guild Hall. Um, 
More page line? Sure. Oh gosh, I'm gonna have a I'm gonna have a guarantee here. That's a uh, treasure hunter and wishing well in here. So we will we will be sure to guess correctly, except that the warrior is probably gonna kill me. Well, it's gonna kill one of these things, which is hopefully gonna be the wishing well. Uh, but I kind of doubt it because the treasure hunter would be so much worse to lose. The other problem is like, okay, well, it wasn't. The other problem, I guess, is like, with you having Guildhall already, like, you're actually in decent position, like, once you get the champion to do stuff. Um, like, I, I can't, I can't, probably can't very effectively kill, um, whatever. Am I really just gonna name Copper and miss every time? I guess so. Okay, apparently not. Uh, well, I discarded a lot of stuff, but I only trashed one thing, which is pretty irritating. Um, I think we pick up Guild Hall right here. Uh, the hero can gain charm. We're gonna hold the treasure hunter, I think, as is. I think we're actually gonna hold both of these as is. Um, I think I don't want Treasure Hunter yet. We definitely do want Hero. Oh, I need to I need to undo this autoplay. In an unusual uh all right. Hero, no warrior, probably yes, treasure hunter? I don't know. Um, maybe we'll wait a turn on it until I can get the second warrior. Yeah, let's let's hold like this. I'll be I'll be fine trashing the silver to to get more turn. Um, good luck. I think it's a wishing well, probably. I don't know. I actually know the hand, so I don't know why I'm like speculating what this guess should be. <laughs> like that's that's so ridiculous that I would try to try to do that. <laughs> They need to like ban having wishing well be wishing for the last card in the deck of more than like five cards. These things just take way too long. People like try to get them exactly right and then often fail anyways. Like scroll up in the log. What everything let me need I need to do I need to do a full accounting. I need to figure out what was in my deck to start with, and now I need to figure out what all I've seen and uh yeah. Anyways. It's obnoxious. It should, it should just like give it to you, like automatically so that people don't do this crap. <laughs> Obviously, like Or, or, I mean, this is, this is where it would actually be really nice to just have, like, the log cut off right, you know, there or something. Although, I guess that would be enough information that you could still, like, do the, do the stupid thing. Um, so. Or you could play on Temple Gates games where the log cuts off except that you can't play Dominion because the interface is such trash. Otherwise, um, and also you couldn't play it because it doesn't actually work on your computer because you're not in a, not in a big enough market for them to care about. And uh, 
Oh, you also have to pay like a hundred something dollars up front. Like, give me a break. Who are these people? Mostly it's the interface is such trash that it's just impossible to play. Like, I, I tried to play a week of whatever. Look at that. Like, did this matter at all? No, it didn't. You had three wishing wells. Um, just gonna, just gonna point out. Well, this treasure hunter will score. We'll get, we'll get some stuff. This could be two wishing wells. Would not be surprised if it were two wishing wells. I don't. I'm not even gonna get a turn, an extra turn of uh, uh, silver, copper. What's in there? Like copper wishing well. I guess we're gonna name copper. See that? I don't have to do that, that stuff. Um, province? I mean, I think so. Let's do it. Uh, champion, yes. Warrior, yes. Treasure hunter, yes. Ooh, do I trash this silver first thing? Probably not. And I don't think there's anything to do other than buy province, so we're gonna we're gonna stick with it. <sighs> I'm a little, I'm, I mean I'm be, I'm behind on the province stuff just because like you have these these charms. What are those cards? Um, remake and wishing well. And I'm hoping to be done gaining a lot of things, right? My hope is to get to the to get to the treasure hunter this turn, which means I guess I should trash silver first. Well, I'd really like to get to the treasure hunter this turn. Investment, huh? Okay, we we did we did get to the treasure hunter. Oh, I could just name Silver again. That's probably the best move. Uh, buy Province. Get the Warrior out. Seems all right. We are we are definitely not letting these pages pages as treasure hunters do do much. Um, what's in here? Uh, warrior. Plus silver. How many wishing wells did I see last turn? Both two. Well, I guess it's warrior. Got to be warrior plus silver. Uh, warrior plus province. No, I drew the province. All right. Warrior plus silver. I'm just trying to province out from here. Um, my one. Kind of unfortunate thing is that I don't have plus buy in this shuffle. Um, but, uh, I don't know. We'll see. You can also remake the spice merchant at some point. Remake like silvers. I don't have a whole lot of faith that this game is going to go very well at this point, but we'll see. Um, I mean, I think I, I think my move is probably just provincing out, but it's also I don't know. Seems potentially overly difficult to do. I mean, like, if I can double province this next turn, though, that puts you in a terrible spot still. Like, even if I can't really, you know, 
whatever next turn. Um, uh, gosh, I was going to name Silver. Okay, well, it was the Spice Merchant, but we're double provincing for sure. No hero. Just just keep this draw. I mean, I think that puts you in a pretty tough spot. I don't really have... Um, I mean, you can't double, but, like, you can probably also somewhat safely speculate that, like, probably I can't double. I mean, I could single from here, which is still, which is still seems good. Uh, and potentially, like, remake, whatever. Um, I guess the hope is single. That might be tough, even, with the, with the one, co with only the one coffer. We'll see. We will see. This is all, like, Silver and one wishing well. Um, I mean, I'd probably even borrow for a province. Okay, that duchy looked necessary. You don't have any investment left. You could theoretically, like, get into one, but I don't think we're going to worry about that. Um, well, do I borrow for borrow for province, or do I go over this shuffle? I think I should go over this shuffle. Okay, um, happy to have done that now, but I'm, now I'm a little bit I don't know sketchy on sketchy on what should come next. Um, we name province. Uh, if we remake two of these into, no, I'm just going to buy the province, say come get me. Like, you could do it, but, eh, I doubt it. Okay, I was, I was fine to doubt it. All right, and then this just buys province, we're, we're already there. Awesome. I want to not my start. Um, I mean, I just greened earlier. I think that was most of it. There, there wasn't like that much play there. Um, so, so that's, that's what that was. Uh, this looks ugly. Yeah, we don't have, um, I mean, I think the opening is clearly Chapel, Jack. Like, what does your vampire actually want to gain? This looks disgusting, actually. Like, there's, there's nothing here. There's just nothing here. Uh, I guess you could, like, put Family Adventures on gold for vampire. That's, that's something you can eventually do. I mean, I think maybe you want to play with one vampire. I think this this is pretty clearly chapel, and then we'll figure it out on the four. Um, hopefully, you have your four first, uh, and then we can we can kind of do either vampire or jack, depending on depending on if you use your inventor token. I guess I could also go like double avoid, That'd be kind of funny. Trash out the estates. Actually, maybe that's better. That might be better. Yeah, I'm actually liking that move quite a lot. Double avoid here. I think actually no matter what you do, because like you're not gonna attack before I'm before I'm trashing out my estates. <laughs> right. Yeah. yeah, that's that's got to be the move. Um. 
This has got to be a move. I think. We're good. Alright, now a decision time. Uh, do I take Vampire? Or do I trash one and take Jack? I think we're gonna trash one and take Jack. I mean, what's Vampire actually doing for us? I mean, I guess the problem is, is you could, um, trash two and take Jack, but whatever. I'm going to ignore, choose to ignore that possibility because it horrifies me too much. Um. <laughs> this will be discard. Discard Copper, Trash Chapel, by Silos. That is how this is gonna, that is how this is gonna work. Maybe by Vampire if, like, you expose it, but... I don't think so. I just don't think, I don't think Vampire has a, okay, Trash Two Coppers, Inventor's Token by Jack, yep. So you get one extra copper out. Let's see, uh, keep, no, discard. We drew from footpad. Uh, silos. Discard two of these. I, mean, I imagine you do about the same thing, unless you like top deck your chapel. I don't think there's any reason to keep the chapel around. I mean, maybe you get vampire attacked and get a curse, at which point I guess Jack will have to, Jack will have to do it for you, but. The other thing we can look at is um, avoids uh, as we kind of ramp stuff up. Okay, um, I think discard this. I'm just going to take a gold, pretty sure. We just want to, we just kind of want to play, play boring money. Work it from there. These nomads seem like such a waste of time. Like I don't think I'm gonna play with vampire. We're just I think we're just gonna We're just gonna see what Jack does. Yeah, I can discard all three of these, because then when I look, it's going to top deck the coppers. Um, probably, well, I guess we actually want to keep this one. No, there's a, there's a silver in there, so let's discard it. And maybe go, like, avoid gold, or just province gold. Or just province. Maybe go avoid gold. Like, I don't know what the point of avoiding right now is though. I guess the, I guess the point is like maybe I start missing if I don't get another gold in, but. Discard an action or treasure, okay. I mean, that didn't do a whole lot. Maybe take footpad. Um, 
footpath would be kind of nice to have just because the coffers is smooth a bit, but I just don't know that there's time. Uh, almost not even for the attack, just, just for, as I say, the, the smoothing. I guess this is getting played now. Um, this actually should discard, and then we'll just buy problems. I might get attacked, footpad attack, it'll be kind of annoying. Actually, it'll be extremely annoying. I'm probably missing province this turn just as a... No, I'm not going to miss province this turn because you couldn't play it. Okay. That resign seemed a little early, but... I'll take it. Anyways, that's that's the fourth win, so I'm almost I'm almost where I want to be at. Um, or I'm I'm to the point where I don't feel like like I'm just dead um, for the season. Um, this board has Exorcist Collection, which isn't like a real combo, but it's something to watch out for because it means that like even despite you know. All this stuff being, I don't know, um, expensive, uh, it still means collection gets to score a lot. Um, I guess we're going to open Double Urchin. Uh, like, you want to get your stuff done pretty quick, and I don't think uh, adding the Wisps early is that productive. I mean, I think we want it at some point, but, like, if you're going to open Urchin, well, I don't know, because it's like, if you open Silver Exorcist, well, we're, we're going to probably buy Urchin here. I was thinking, like, if you open Silver Exorcist, right, um, you still probably don't hit five, which would be kind of a big goal. Uh, so I think we're just going to do both Urchins. Oh, we collided them. What a miracle. I love this game. Did you collide yours? No. Okay. That's, that's sweet. Um, it also means that if it draws a copper, I'm totally taking Exorcist. And then Silver. Um, that is a lot of urchins. Do I take Exorcist again? Probably not. I think now I take Urchin. I'm not, I'm not like that into, that into stuff. Oh, this is disgusting. Um, I'm going to miss some big numbers. Uh, yeah, so that's annoying. Um, I could grab an imp right here, and I think I will just ta do that. Uh, do I even hold the estates? Maybe. Mercenary missing irritates me. I think we're, we're going to hold the estates. Exorcist can trash copper well enough. Uh, I mean, it's not like I wiped one out on the on the last turn. So, look, you even played Merc before me. See how much good any all of this does. <laughs> and you're hitting five again. Well, this is bad. Um, Exorcist is going to miss a miss hitting a thing again. Gonna, just gonna point out. Um, I don't really need another Merc in that particular shuffle. Like this stuff's already here. So this this game's going not quite as as well. I'm gonna I'm gonna say. Um, which you know, this stuff things happen. Alright, um, I think this is pretty clearly crown. Uh, I have, should have enough stuff in there to, to village effectively. Um, 
we discard. I mean, I'm gonna probably discard the Exorcist. I guess we discard Silver Exo. Uh, Cause like, what what could that have drawn that I would be unhappy with? Um, maybe another crown. The imp is doing me actually quite a lot. I'm gonna point out. Um, this could actually be emissary already. So I'm about to shuffle trigger with the imp. Yeah. I like that move. I thought I was about to shuffle trigger with the imp. Maybe I'm not. Maybe you're not going to trash. I don't know what this... I mean, there's got to be like a crown in there, right? That's interesting. Why would you do that? I mean, you can trash two mercs next turn. Very thin. Okay. Well, that's amazing. I love Imp. Uh, it would be amazing if this mercenary were to not draw the, the emissary. Then I'd probably pick up, like, collection, actually, uh, over another crown. I might pick up collection anyways. Um, okay, well, we're not going to do that because we're only hitting four. Uh, but like this can be silver. Oh, it could also be pilgrimage. That seems like a that seems like a good idea. Well, maybe not like an amazing idea, but good enough. Anyways. Um, I quite like where I'm at, actually. Uh, we have this we have this exorcist sitting here, or we have this emissary sitting here waiting to be like amazing draw. Your econs in the t dump. We're gonna trash two coppers. We're gonna take a collection. Do I trash this uh, silver fur wisp? I guess it would probably be better than imp. But no, I think it's better just right now still. Uh, I mean, I just want to crown the emissary, right? Oh, I guess we'll have actions after it. <laughs> That's amazing. That is amazing. Um, play that. Uh, we'll trash the Merc. This will be pilgrimage for like Crown Emissary Collection. Uh, I think we're just kind of off. Yeah. All right. Yeah, I mean, I think you just went down too far in that game. Um, five is a good number of wins. Uh, it puts me even for the season. It means I'm probably avoiding demotion. Um, and that's that's really all I could have asked for uh, at that point. Um, and yeah, um, well, I guess I'll be probably seeing y'all next season in A again. So, see you all.